All right. <clears throat> All right. In the blue, we have Wildfire and in the orange, Riff. Let's, I believe this is CLMN. I'm unofficially casting this, so it sounds cringe after the broadcast. I'll blame it on the fact that I've never done this before. And I'm just doing it for fun because Minnie's my friend, so let's do it. And he sets one, tries to put on target, completely whiffs. But blue is on the attack here. See how much longer they can hold this pressure. Breakaway for uh, Riff. Hold on, let me figure out their whole names here. This is scuffed as frick. Burnsville Wired Wildfire. And Rochester Riff. Alright. Got the full names now. Cool. No goals have happened, so we're good. Nothing missed. Eating ramen. Oh! Open net for Riff, but a complete whip. Two complete whiffs. Open opportunities for Orange Team, but they couldn't capitalize. Now Blue on the counterattack. Mini tries to put one away. Almost gives it completely up for another open net. But Blue recovers, and Orange once again on the prowl. Coffin puts it past two, gets demoed for his troubles. Rad tries to center it to Mini, but it's taken away by Checkers or Checker. I don't know how to say that name. Uh, Coffin tries to pass to Mini as they put it downfield, looking for an opportunity to put one away for the blue. Rad misses one in the air, and it's back to the um, Rochester Rifts. A good shot by PC, but blocked by Blue. Once again, another good shot saved by Rad this time. Neither team really finding any other than the open opportunities on on Blue's net. There have been no real free nets for either team. Close game so far in game number one. Of this best of five. Coffin, what's best? Mate, it's Nate. Crazy name. Beautiful. Coffin. Puts it up the sidewall. Looking to do some sort of ceiling shot, but gets blocked by Mate. A Mate trying to center it for his team. Puts it down the middle, but Rad takes it away for the blue team. But Orange still holds the pressure. Blue's having a bit of a struggle trying to get it out of their half. Jo uh, Mini almost misses that ball, but it gets a pretty good save. Clears it to the corner. And blue team so far is out of the woods, but they might have gotten scored on. And Rochester Rifts takes the first goal in this game. This looks like uh, Coffin put his team in a fairly bad spot with that miss on the backboard. A tough read, but just not a great situation for his other two teammates who were expecting a touch out of him. And so they get scored on. They have two minutes to make it up, though, so this game could go either way. Oh, and just like that, a mistake on the orange team. As PC hits it backwards and then fakes out his teammate and bumps him. PC really not having a great state of affairs there on the <laughs> on the orange half. Oh, shoot. I just realized all the icons are here. Okay. We're good now. I think... Yeah. Wait, are we fine? 
Yeah, okay. Mini. Puts it back up the wall. No, just kidding, it bounces out. Blue, looking to get the ball out of their half once again. But it seems like Orange has open pressure, almost capitalizes on that open net, but couldn't get to it in time. Now Blue's on the, Blue's on the attack, trying to set up their teammates. A good pass to the middle by Coffin, but Mini wasn't looking for such a far pass. That's rolling up the sidewall. As it looks like two of the uh, players on the field, Rad and I believe uh, Check, are in a a bit of a lock right now. So we're having a two v two. We'll see which duo can outsmart the other one. Just kidding. It seems like the lock was broken up, and now we're back to three v three. Unfortunate, but. Oh no, just kidding, they're back. And Mini, wow. I did not see how that happened, but he, wow, it just seemed like an open goal for, for him. Good shot, to be fair. Excuse me while I take some bites of my ramen. Enjoy the beautiful game audio. Sorry, I'm pretty hungry right now. Mmm. <laughs> a good shot from Coffin with an even better pass from Rad. He saw his teammate up the field and passed it directly to him for a good redirect. And that, that was a really quick counterattack that caught the orange team off guard. Now a 2-0 lead, or a 3-1 lead for uh, Wildfire. Looks like they'll probably take this game. I'm not sure how they wouldn't. <sighs> and indeed, the first game goes to <sighs> Wildfire Bruins Burnsville Wildfire. Sorry. <sighs> and that's a pretty close game for most of it. The second half kind of got out of the uh, orange team's reach though so blue will look to keep that pressure in the second game keep the momentum going orange they got to figure out what went wrong in that match there were a few personal uh whiffs and mistakes but also some good plays on the blue team so let's hope they can figure out what they're what they need to do kickoff sails towards the orange net but a quick quick ball control from uh, blue or rather the orange team kind of gave it away on accident to uh, the blue team it's centered beautifully for mini who comes in charges takes advantage of where that ball was going and puts in the bottom left corner of the net none of the orange team expected it and that's a quick 1-0 lead for the uh, for wildfire let me let me see if I can put on the names of the teams here add some text or something I feel like I can do this oh apologies how do I edit this oh another goal for blue team I didn't exactly see what happened that time because I'm trying to put it in text here And on the other side, um, we can have title left. I should have done this before, but I didn't actually think about it. <laughs> Let me uh, 
<clears throat> a goal for orange. Hey, look, let me just tab in back here and see what happened. It's like many put it to the side, but oh, a great shot from PC. Beautiful follow up off that ceiling bounce. And neither the defenders and that really saw it coming. So it beat them to the back of the net. Beautiful goal from the Rochester Riffs. Uh, let me go back to my stream, see. What I need to change here. Um, that's not right. <laughs> Wait, what the heck? What's up, Isaac? Hello? Hey. Hello? 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 Well, I have 800 ping. Can you hear me? I can hear you, yeah. Um, right. I'm, I'm currently on streaming. I'm, I'm like streaming this as if I'm uh, <laughs> the unofficial caster here. So, not very good, but happening. I've even, I finally set up text showing the team names on my stream labs. So most of this game I've been doing that. Nice. Oh. Oh my gosh, this is... A good setup from Rad, but an unfortunate miss from him and Coffin puts Mini in an awkward spot. A good defensive hold, though, will keep the blue team from being uh, scored on, tied up. Both teams contesting for the midfield. Big booming clear from blue puts it at, towards orange. Uh, excuse me, still drinking and eating food. I'm gonna have to join from my phone. That is totally fine, brother. I'll be back. Sounds good. Um, yeah. Oh, good passing play from blue, but mini unfortunately puts it too weak onto the net. The defenders were able to get back and save it. All right. Check her out. Beautiful. Beautiful audio quality. <laughs> <laughs> I can only imagine. Oh, yeah. Good news, though. Apparently, uh, Midco is going to come out tomorrow. And, uh,. We'll have internet by like 12. Yo! Yeah. So, or I guess 12. That's yeah, 12. dope. Pretty exciting. Yeah. Mm. Well, that's that's assuming all goes according to plan, so I take that with a grain of salt. Right. Our game tied back up again after some personal mistake on the blue side, but now rad some good uh, mechanical play i couldn't tell if it was because of him or oh a good bump from mini on the back line bumps the defender out of the way rad shoots and the, and the goalie did not see it coming he did not see his teammate being bumped there so again another lead for blue team but they'll have to hold it this time if they want to secure the lead they're looking to add on some more Watching this at like quite literally like five frames per second. That's <laughs> incredible. <laughs> Truly. And good luck with that. Uh, Orange team has the pressure now. They have an open chance, but a good save from Rad. Placement wasn't good enough for the Orange team. They sent it too close to a defender. He was able to clutch it up and keep them in the lead. Rochester Rifts still looking for an opportunity to equalize and come back in the series, because if they lose the second game, they will have to perform a reverse sweep to end the series with a win. And they're probably not looking to do that. It's hard to get momentum back for a reverse sweep. It is possible. Has been done. Especially in a best of five, but a great shot from Coffin will seal this game. Essentially, unless something miraculous happens. Good pass from Mini, and then a... Um, 
good steal from Coffin, so I guess it was Minnie's shot originally that I was impressed with. We'll have to see if the Rochester Rifts can recover in the next game. Give them some chance against this hot wildfire Burnsville wildfire team. <coughs> Newly picked up, I believe, and a great doink from Mini Nakwan will again seal the deal on this game. Put, <laughs> forgive me for this, but put them in their coffins in game number two, as Coffin will look to help his team win. Game number three and sweep the Rochester Rips. You couldn't be more right. <laughs> That's, of course, of course. And no GGs from the Rochester Rips. You know they're feeling the pressure. They're feeling the pain. They didn't like how that game went. But was that game one? Oh, it was game number two. Game one. Um. Um. The Wildfire one as well. Oh. All right. I need a serious. Score on my brick, on my stream. Ah, this is terrible. I'm so bad at this. <laughs> there we go. I, I'm doing it, guys. I got this. There we go. Two zero. Hey, hey, that. Oh shoot. All right, now it works. Okay. Oh shoot! I gotta spectate. My bad. All right. Now we're chilling. There. Okay. Now we're on director again. Sorry about that. We are totally fine now. Although a miraculous swan, some sort of dance happened. Some sort of ritual, as Minia and Coffin both sort of. Kiss the ball with the error of their jumps. Nothing really happened, so. Whatever they were trying to do didn't work. Orange team. That's a free goal out of it. Taking their lucky stars. That's probably the freest goal they will receive this whole series. Although it looks like they might be going for round two. And they get another goal in the opening 30 seconds. 33 seconds. Very quickly capitalized, made his nape, completely beat the backline uh, defender for blue. Just like that, orange team. Whoa. Coffin pops it up for red. We tries to air dribble it to the middle. He sees trying to defend it in net, and he actually did not play. He didn't play that very well, but. Mini gave him a lot of respect and couldn't score. He expected a little bit better defense from him. Maybe that's what Orange is going for, of course. No fakes in, in uh, champ, Grand Champ 1 and 2. Blue team looking to put on the pressure. Get a goal back after leaving two fairly easy nets for Orange to score. But it looks like Orange is the pressure right now. And it's mounting against Blue Team. They're huddled in the corner, struggling to space out. Check, drops it to Mate, but Mate Snape wasn't really ready for that touch. Mini touch puts it down, tries to find a teammate, but unfortunately just finds the other team. Guy drops the coffin, who pops it. Up for Mini to try to air dribble this in, but check with a good drop down to his teammate. Clears it away. But it's still on the orange half, and it's dangerous now. A double commit on the back line. Blue could try to capitalize, but it's a slow ball, so it's hard to do anything with it. Coffin up now, tries to put it middle. Softer than he was hoping for, so he has to try to dunk the defender again, but that didn't work out for him. Hold on. Messing up the stuff again. I'll leave you with some good old game audio as I finish up my ramen. <laughs> Wait, hold on. This is director, right? No, this is auto cam. Okay, here we go.
They didn't pay me for this, so I can do whatever I want. <laughs> you have all the control. Exactly. Ooh. Pretty good passing play. Very slow, but good C by uh, Check putting it down back to mate. It's Nate. A good one two. Uh, good one two one passing play for the Rochester Riffs. We're kind of running away with this game three, where all the momentum the first two games looked like Wildfire might take this in a complete sweep. So the reverse sweep is definitely possible. As long as, as long as the rifts can complete the, or keep the momentum going through this game and keep it up, but they just let one through. Coffin fires a banger at the top left of the net. Orange team accidentally putting it right out to him. Not the best clear from PC, I believe. Just like that, Wildfire might be back in this game. One to three now. For the <clears throat> Burnsville Wildfire team. They will do their best to keep themselves in it, but Rochester Riffs are hungry for their first game win of the series. So they'll probably do everything possible that they can. But a good pass. Mm, a good pass from Mini Knockmon. But Rad or Coffin, I couldn't tell which one. Couldn't find the back of the net. And now Orange on the counterattack. PC tries to put a pass too. Gets dunked for his trouble. And again, another counterattack. Blue on orange this time, but saved once again by the defender. Just booming clears back and forth for teams trying to catch the other team off guard. And it might happen here. Oh, but a missed opportunity from orange. A feels bad man moment as the crossbar is hit <laughs> once again. A very odd rule one oh. occurring, but blue is still not able to capitalize. Did not work in their favor, and they might get scored on here, but no, saved away by Rad. He pops it to the middle, to Coffin, up to Mini, who tries to do something, but he couldn't fake out the defender. And Blue still struggling, looking for their second goal. Looking like Rochester's probably going to take this game three and keep themselves alive in the series. So finishing ramen, so... Give that good save from Rad though. <sighs> and game number three. Going to Rochester Rifts. Looking to make the reverse sweep. It didn't look possible from those first two games. It looked like the games were going completely in Wildfire's favor. However, Rochester Rifts brings it back with a 3 1 goal lead. And it looks fairly convincing, too. Burnsville Wildfire are going to be kicking themselves after that one. Because there were definitely some... There was a very big mistake from a couple of the members in the first goal. The second goal, they just got beat. So they're going to want to <laughs> try to get the momentum swinging back in their favor. Because the last goal scored in the last game was by them. So we'll see if Wildfire can bring it back in their favor and end this series on a win. Rochester can bring this to a game five. PC jumps for this jumps for the ball, tries to put it to the wall for a teammate, but it gets dunked. Mate drops it down. Mini can't find any touch on the ball. Now Rad tries to 50 it to the middle for a teammate. Often tries to set it up for his backboard buddy who sets it to the middle. Mini didn't want to commit though, because he was the last man back. He didn't want to commit too hard, and he, they almost ran into trouble there. Ball and Blue's half transferred to Orange, though, with a good carry from Rad, who puts in middle. PC tries to 50 to get out of his half, but is unable to do so as Blue continues to put the pressure on. A made it's Nate, puts it to the wall, beats Mini. Looks like Orange, they made it out of their own half with some passing. Out of time. Dang it.
Oh, a good pass from Coffin from the back line. Mini tries to redirect it in, but it didn't have quite enough power to get it past any defenders. Now, Orange on the counterattack, maybe. Gets stopped by Rat at the midfield, though. Blue's having much better midfield presence this game than they did last game, because they're stopping a lot of these chances, but... Ooh, almost a chance for the Rochester Rifts. <clears throat> as they get... They had a free opportunity, almost, but they get demoed. And here's a good goal. Or <laughs> here's the first goal of this game. <laughs> coming out from the Wildfire as Mini sets it against the wall. And Rad has a, has a fairly difficult angle to hit as he drifts into the ball. Or drifts around just enough to get a good angle on that. And hits it far post, beating every defender. So good play to start the game off. The score off, sorry. We're halfway through the game. My first time casting, man. I'm trying my best. You're killing it, dude. Thanks, dude. Let's go. Um, okay, what was next? Okay, I look away from the screen for one second and the ball's hovering on the goal line. It goes in. Rochester riffs. Equalize. Oh. I couldn't tell. I think it was Ch um, PC who dropped the ball in the coffin who tried to hit it out or above at his own crossbar. But unfortunately, it bounced in at such a precarious position right in front of the goal that Blue were not able to recover. It's a 1-1 game tied up. Game number four. What a nail biter. Oh shoot, I forgot to uh, give the Rochester Riffs their first point in my uh, stream. So forgive me while I do that for a second. Um, there we go, they get a game. There you go. All right. Orange now looking to take the lead and continue their comeback. Wildfire's not looking to let that happen. Mini drops it down to Rad, who tries to double tap it. Is unable to do so, and oh, check looking for an, another nasty counterattack redirect. I couldn't find it, it was too difficult. Orange having some pretty good opportunities, but Blue's getting away with some spooky defense here. Blue try to counterattack, but Orange still has the pressure. They put it back into the blue half. Check. Has a great 50. Gets a double commit out of Wildfire as Coffin accidentally puts it on his backboard. Blue's having some... A little bit of... Can't quite explain what's going on. They're having some scared rotations. They're panicking a little bit too much on the goal line. They're doing some double commits. If Orange can keep putting the pressure on, I'm sure they can get a go out of blue eventually. PC puts it up, tries to go for some sort of pass or doomsy dish. Unable to do so. Taken away by blue. Blue booms the ball into the orange half. Trying to find any way possible to get past the defense. So far they've only had one game the whole or one goal this game. I think this is the lowest score line of any game we've seen so far. Defense might be getting better for both teams, or their offense is just failing, who knows? I'm no analyst. <laughs> A good 50 by Coffin, puts it over, Rad puts it over to Mini, and Mini scores with only three seconds left. Rochester Rift's lives are on the line because of this accidental own goal by Mate, it's Nate. Very unfortunate for him. Absolutely tragic. But a great, <laughs> but a great attempt from, or great <laughs> forced own goal from Mini. Will end the game at for, for a win for Wildfire three one. Well played to the Wildfire, uh, Burnsville Wildfire and Rochester Rifts. It looks like Burnsville Wildfire will be taking this game. Thanks all to thanks to all who uh, 
watch this. I don't know if anyone was really interested, but hope you enjoyed time during the stream. That was very unofficial cast. Still hope you enjoyed though. Peace out everybody. Have a great day. Have a great one.